Hey guys, welcome back to another Coding Flamingo video. In today's video, we're gonna talk about something that we have been thinking for a while and we finally made the decision at Kitos of stop using Maui. Uh, we gave it a try. We were one of the first beta users to use it. I even talked about it in Maui Fest. I talked about how it was great and it was getting there and how we were able to create uh, one of our applications um, in literally two weeks just because we used our Blazor components and we were able to do all that. And we have two production applications. So we have Easy SSH and Easy CMS that both run on Maui. Uh, we have been developing them since 2021. And it just got to the point where we couldn't deal with this anymore. And we're moving to Avalonia UI. Um, but in here, I'm going to ask so i see i read a bunch of posts is maui ready is it not ready why is it not ready and all those things so i'm gonna try to go through some of our biggest pain points if you have other pain points leave them down in the comments down below delivering to app stores is a pain uh one of our biggest pains and kind of embarrassment was we are a Microsoft partner. We work with Microsoft a lot and we work with Microsoft customers. And we had a customer saying like, hey, can we deploy your apps through Intune? And I was like, well, it's a Microsoft product, so probably we can. And no, nope, uh, it doesn't work in Intune. Someone posted about it September. I posted about it, I, I asked in October. In October 31st, no one has responded. Not even the team acknowledging it, no, nothing. So like this shows kind of like, the level of emphasis of Microsoft just really not caring about the user experience. And um, I actually want to shout out some of the people in, in the dev team are uh, amazing and they will try to find ways to unblock you and help you. If you go through the GitHub issues, they'll try to unblock, but you know, we, at, at the end of the day, I need a, a platform that can do what I needed to and not have to think, is this a bug in my code? Is this a bug in the platform? Uh, what do we have to do? So another one that uh, I kind of showed on the screen, but I didn't talk about is Amcel straight up not supported in Mac. They decided it was too hard and they cut it <laughs> and they called it done. So, I mean, I had to create a video about how to do it. Um, so I have it here, like, hey, the authentication in Maui Mac, because they don't want to do it and they don't want to support it. Another one, uh, we run our application as administrator. When you do the build application, um, the package gets signed, but the actual executable that runs doesn't get signed. So we brought that up and they said like, well, we're just using the publish for app. Um, so figure it out. Thankfully, we are a cryptography company, so we figure it out. And thankfully, I do YouTube as a hobby, so I created a video. So if you have that problem, now you know how to fix it. Other than that, we have some videos on like building the application just because there's not a lot of stuff out there. Uh, the Windows tray icon. So having like the icon at the top and having the title at the top, something that should come through the application. There is no information, no documentation. I had to kind of reverse engineer the uh, application, the demo application that they had uh, to see how it was and then create the video. This is something that just added to the template. It's not that hard. I don't know why they haven't done that. Last but not least, no Linux support. You cannot call a multi-platform without Linux support. Um, there was supposed to be a kind of like community driven thing that they were trying to get it to do it, but there is no support for that. And these are kind of like the main ones I could keep going on and on, but there is no point. I'm not going to be using Maui anymore. I'm going to be giving a try to Avalonia UI. Uh, we're actually going to start the migration um, in a couple of weeks. So if you have any recommendations on either if we're going the right way, that's the research we did and it seems to be the most supported. But if you have any comments or anything, let us know. And now that we're starting a brand new framework, let me know what videos you want to see about this. But other than that, thank you so much for watching and thank you for uh, your support these two years doing uh, Maui videos. Hopefully you'll like the Avalonia videos as well.